We have nine resident bat species in Ireland and all use hedges. The network of hedges in the Irish countryside provide corridors for movement as well as habitat for feeding and roosting bats. Tina Ockney, Bat Conservation Ireland, will tell us more. Well, bats, because they are nocturnal mammals, and while they're not a blind mammal, they rely on echolocation. And in order to facilitate echolocation, bats use linear habitats, such as hedgerows, to be able to fly through the landscape. So a hedgerow is like our roadways. It is a commuting route for bats to allow them to fly through the landscape from their uh, roosting site to their preferred foraging habitats. So if the hedgerow is a good dense hedgerow, lots of insects, they will forage as they're commuting. They only eat insects and they eat a phenomenal amount of insects. The typical pipistrelle, such as the common pipistrelle or soprano pipistrelle, will feed on about 3,000 insects in one night. So bats will fly, are only flying at night time and typically it's the common pipistrelle. So if you see something flitting up and down, doing these lovely circles about three, four meters along the actual height of the hedgerow, that's your pipistrelles. Bats are very small, so the pipistrelles are typically the size of my thumb. That's the body of it, but their wingspan can range from about 26 centimetres to 32 centimetres. Uh, so our biggest bat is the Lyser's bat, which would fit into the palm of my hand, but would have a wingspan about a foot. They will only roost in good mature trees in the hedgerows, so that's why it's very important to retain some of our trees in, in our hedgerows, because you need nice uh, uh, tree holes or split limbs. So anything that's a little bit of damage on the actual trees provides a space, the bats will actually roost in that space. Bats are a very important mammal as they keep down our insect populations, but they're also a very good indicator on how good our habitats are. So when you have a good, healthy population of bats, it tends to indicate that our local habitats and our landscape is in good condition.